Good evening, YouTube. It's 9.27 p.m. Feels like it's 1 in the morning. But, uh... I'm in North Carolina, Forest City, and I live by a uh, a plant. It looks like a nuclear plant because it it l lets out large plumes of water vapor into the sky, and. This evening and this morning, as I was going to work, I looked up into the sky and I seen a purplish glow on the clouds. And it looked similar to the blue glow in certain videos that are out there on YouTube. And, you know, I, I said, gosh, wow. And when I came back after work, I looked again, and it was still there. So, uh, you know, I began to, to, to wonder, what, what is it? It looked like, a, it looked like a, a black light. It had a purplish color to it. But, it, you know, I, I just, something just popped in my head that I had to make a video. And uh, what, what these lights are, they're emitting maybe a close to invisible light because I can still see it, but it's pretty it's pretty hard to see it if you're not really looking. But I feel like the, these lights are emitting some type of freak frequency to to put us in a certain mood, or or to keep us sort of like docile or even emitting this light that, you know, it's, it's not a bright light. You don't have to have a bright light to, in order to emit and receive uh, data. So, you know, I think these lights are something like the Li-Fi, uh, the LED light bulbs that transmit information via the the light waves now the, that right there that's old you know we think oh it's new it's upcoming but they've been using this for for over 50 years when, when they found out how to use frequency to heal or to hurt they were using light frequency also so it's all in the same scientific realm but you know this light it, it really scared me the light really really scared me because I know that there's no uh, cities or stores with bright purple lights anywhere around so uh, you know, I'm looking at it now, and it's so it's so faint that you can't see it. But I know it's there because it's a purplish color. So I'm making this video just just to let you know. You know, YouTube is changing. I'm gonna see if I get other platforms that I could just be me. I don't want to be put into a, a box of like I'm a white supremacist because I'm, I'm not uh, just because we name these people who are criminals it doesn't make us like nationalists are not neo-nazi you know white supremacist it's all that's all the who's saying it calling us and then they have the nerve to have right after that segment, they they put a man living infested with roaches. That's that's just that's total total programming. They're basically calling us the cockroaches. <laughs> it's amazing.
it's amazing what people believe and it's amazing what they put out there what's going to come next 2020 and 2021 is the years that everything changes and everything is going to be rolled out Moloch he's in Rome he's majestically standing with the great the great philosophers like Plato and Socrates, he's up there with them. You know, my, my heroes were never celebrities. My heroes were never actors or, you know, you know who is my celebrities? Who, who was my role models? My role models were from the first prophet to the last prophet. And they got us fighting each other when we are all one big family. But these social engineers, they did a good job. They did a pretty good job in, in manipulating stuff, you know? And yeah, their maritime law, they, they deal in, in different laws than us, but you know, it's fine. What they made illegal, uh, what God has made legal, they made illegal. And what God made illegal has now become legal. And their peace building initiative that the UN is going to put forth will, will usher in this new age of uh, Moloch and, and pedophilia and openness. And it's just so satanic. It's do as that wilt. And it's, it's, it's amazing. I remember how vibrant, I remember how vibrant the, the fall colors were. And now just like Jeremy, uh, at a plain, a plain truth for you, I believe that's his channel. He, he was observing the, the, the grapes and, and just the tree, the colors of the tree. It doesn't look vibrant anymore. You know, they, they have successfully changed the earth's natural balance. And with a little push that they give, they can get a bigger push back in response and, and we could see it. It's all over the world. It's happening now. This, uh, it's going to get worse and worse. And I've been noticing the changes in the climate and in the seasons, how it's a little off. But, you know, now I really noticed the, the, the fall colors. They're not, they're dark colors now. Dark browns, dark just it's mostly brown colorish and this is not only in california this is probably worldwide because they're they have successfully changed earth's climate and they're blaming us for it we we drive too many cars when they're the ones that produce those cars oh you you're farting too much the cows are letting out methane and it's it's crazy, man. Everything works in balance. Everything on earth has a job to do. Just study, see, see, study animals. Study the natural ecology of a, of a, a, a region. You could, everyone can see the change, but you know, it's, you're a conspiracy theorist, you know. You're a domestic terrorist now, and it's sad.